Hi, you're watching App Sites. My name is Shaman. I give app and website tutorials and reviews. And today I'm gonna to be talking about the Yuka app. The Yuka app is an app that allows you to rate your food and personal care items so you can see how healthy or unhealthy they are. So let's get into it. This is the Yuka app and I'm gonna open it up. So the first thing you're gonna notice is there's a long list of food here. And these are items that I've scanned and I've gotten the ratings for. And you can see some say poor, some say excellent. I'll explain more about that in a second. On the bottom right hand corner, there's a green circle with a scanner image in, a, in it. So I'm going to click on that. And I have a few food items here to scan. The first one is some crackers. So you can see I scanned it and it's very quick. So you can actually see that these crackers are rated 35 out of 100. The closer to 100 an item is, the healthier it is, and the closer to zero, the, the less healthy it is. So the negatives are displayed at the top, and you can see it has too much salt and a bit too many calories. And then positives are, are, are beneath that. So some positives about it is it has uh, it's a decent source of protein. It has um, uh, low sugar and it has additives, two additives, but they're not risky. So you can scroll down a little more and you can actually see some recommendations and the recommendations will be for options that are healthier. So you can see there are more crackers and some are rated 84 out of 100, 60 out of 100. So this gives you different options so you can choose a healthier option. So if I wanted to, I can click this star at the top and I added that item to the favorite so I can always find that item later. So I'm gonna X out of that and I'm gonna scan another food item. That was really quick. And these are some noodles and these noodles are rated zero out of 100. So that's as bad as you can get. So you can see it has nine additives. One of them is hazardous and you can see it's E621 monosodium glutamate. And you click on it and it'll give you information about what's unhealthy about it. And then on the bottom, they have things that say learn more and scientific sources. And if you click on those links, you'll get more information about how this item was found hazardous or information about how this, um, this information was, was obtained for this. So you can see the other items here from hazardous to not risky at all. So then when you scroll up, you can see more item, more reasons why this is considered unhealthy. It's a little bit too much saturated fat, uh, too much salt and so on and so forth. So when you scroll down, you can actually see positives. It has low sugar, uh, it has some fiber in it, but then you can see recommendations again for some healthier options for noodles. So I'm gonna X out of that. Now, in addition to food, you can also scan personal care items. So I have some cream here. So this is some, um, you can see it says all natural, no bite uh, or no bite meat cream. So this is actually like for keep mosquitoes and stuff away and bugs away. So you can see 65 out of 100 and it's good and that's green. So you see green, you'll see like an orange color, you'll see a yellow and you'll see a red. Red is bad, green is good, and the others are somewhat in between. So you can see yellow, there's low risk, so that's it's not it's not bad at all. So that is that. So when you come back, that opened up by default. At the top left, you can see the white carrot there that is underneath that. See right there. So to the right of that, you can see an arrow pointed left and an arrow pointed right. This is just a long list of all the foods that I scanned and the recommendations here, because it always gives you healthy options. So I'm gonna click see more recommendations for the noodles. So you can see an even longer list of some healthier options for those noodles that I scanned. Then to the right of that, there's like bars, three bars and you can see top products. So beauty is the first one that it opens up to and you can actually see deodorants, body washes, and all of these are not influenced by the manufacturer. This is based off the reviews and the information that they're able to pull together from the ingredients in these products. 
So that's one good thing that's transparent and it lets you know that on Yuka's website and as you look uh, up information about this app and the company. So I'm gonna click on deodorants and you're gonna see different deodorants rated from the best or the most healthy to a little less healthy down here. And these are actually all rated in a 90, so they're pretty good. And then you can drill into it and open it up and you can get more information about it. And this is very good. No risk at all for any of the ingredients. It's natural, it's 100 out of 100. So that is something that is, uh, that is good. So you can find healthy products. It's all about alternatives and eating healthier and being healthier. Uh, so then uh, click food and you can see the different categories of food. So I'm going to go, let's just click on ice cream and see what happens. Takes a little while to open up, but uh, you can see these are different types of ice cream or things that fall into the ice cream category. Like it could be frozen yogurt and you can see uh, what's rated pretty well. And that's good if you just wanna to go to that particular category. Now, if you click on, now this is free. You can download this app for free. You can use it, you can scan it, use a, use a phone to scan it. You have no issues, it works well. Uh, but if you did want to get a premium version, they do have that where you can pay what you want, or at least at the time when I did this, I, I joined premium because I wanted to support what they, what they were doing. And you can pay a different amount. There's like a slider and you $10, $20 a year, whatever it is you want to you wanna pay. So when you do pay, you have the option of using this offline, like if you have no cell phone service, you uh, want to become a premium member, you can actually download a list of these items so it can be used offline. And also, if you go back to this first tab at the top left, there's a search icon there. You can actually type in a specific item and then you can, um, you can see and get a rating from it, from just typing it in. So I'm just gonna just type in a different product like ice cream and then you see a list of ice creams, but you can also type in a specific brand and you can get that uh, that brand, uh, you know, wh whatever you want to type in and you can get it. So that's another benefit if you wanted to go premium and support them. But once again, this is free and this can help you get a uh, better control of your health. And I just wanted to share this so everybody can be as healthy as you can be. Thanks for watching. If that was helpful, give it a thumbs up. I'm going to be doing more app and website tutorials and reviews, so subscribe so you can stay up to date with my videos. I'll catch you on the next one.